hi guys and welcome back to my channel if you are new here welcome my name is pia and i am a 22 year old girl from norway and this video is going to be about me reading assumptions that you guys have about me I asked you guys on Instagram if you had any assumptions of me and I thought it would be a little funnier if I weren't alone in this video so Panda <laughs> is behind the camera right now Hello uh, and he is going to read the assumptions <coughs> Wait COVID? No, just kidding okay. Are you excited? Yeah, I'm so excited <laughs> Okay, first one is from only good vibes 19 you smell good so <laughs> i'm guessing he's assuming that you smell good i feel like i do though like i i, I, I shower like <laughs> <laughs> no, you do yeah i i shower regularly i use body lotion and deodorant and stuff yes. like that so yes I think he I smell does good. smell good you have correct correct i Assume that you like to always clean your house from Kulustoa. <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> I I feel like I feel like I do though. Like I love. I feel like that's wrong though. I mean, I can. We both are like this. Like we can live with the mess, but we both are like shit. <laughs> we need to clean the apartment. Guys, right, imagine two gamers living together. Yeah. Do you think Anyone likes to clean the house. It's basically that, but sometimes I get like uh, tongs tanka. If you, I get like thoughts that you have to clean the apartment now. If you don't clean the apartment, Panda's gonna be so angry at you. What? He's gonna break up with you because you're true, bad true, girlfriend. True, true. <laughs> <No>. <laughs> so I, I clean. I yeah, we like to clean the apartment together as well. Yeah. Let me see from Cash M C H that you you're a lover not a fighter yeah i definitely am or am i not no you're not a fighter yeah no i i definitely i'm more of like a i see things more lighthearted. like i i don't feel the need to be very aggressive kind of because i'm not an aggressive person like at all true so i feel like i'm i'm definitely more a lover than a fighter Facts. Facts. Um, Gabrielle assumes that you speak at least four languages. Mm, Do you? No. I speak fluently English and Norwegian. Uh, Two. And then I speak a little Korean. Three. And I know some Spanish, but like I can't speak it, basically. Speak some Spanish words. Hola, como estas? Well, that's so basic. <laughs> yeah, I know, but that's what I remember. Viva and Noruega, <laughs> something like that. Okay, so yeah, she kind of speaks four languages, I guess. Um, and the JD eight hundred. Eight hundred. Uh, he assumes that you are funny, easygoing, smart, and you have lots of creativity and a good conversation. I mean, all of the assumptions are so positive. I don't know what to say to that. Do you feel that you are smart and funny? <laughs> Are you, do you make me laugh a lot? Yes, I do. Am I not the one that makes us laugh together? Yes, but I also make you laugh sometimes. Wait, when's the last time? I, earlier when, I, <laughs> when we were on our way to the oh, car. Oh, that's me though. No, when I had the tip on my thing, the hoodie oh, yeah, thing. Yeah, true, true. yeah, true. She looked kind of goofy though. She yeah, did. I feel like he laughs about how I look and that's how I make him laugh. <laughs> She's so Basically. goofy looking sometimes. <laughs> Karim Bakri 10 says, I don't know why, but I feel that you are organized person. Are you organized? I feel like I'm organized in my head, like things we do basically, like if we have to travel. Yeah. I'm very organized with like planning things. Yeah. Organized That's planner. True. But true. I feel like I can live in a very or unorganized state. At the same time, yes. very organized. I guess I'm not like a crazy person about being like organized, but definitely when we're traveling and stuff, I always take the lead because I like to. Five boiled potatoes. Yes. 
When you sleep, you end up kicking Panda out of bed so he sleeps on the floor. <laughs> this guy is assuming the right thing. No, <laughs> this is so wrong. <laughs> if it's anyone that's active when we're sleeping, it's Panda for yeah. sure. Like w when I make our bed, for example, it, the duvet, end of the duvet cover is on w at our feet. But when we wake up in the morning, it's flipped. And then I turn it back to the right side and then it's flipped again. He yeah. does it every night. Okay, okay. I don't Supposed even know how okay. he... <laughs> no, so she doesn't kick me in the sleep, she does. King Daniel says, always carry crab sticks in your purse for a quick snack. <laughs> Imagine having crab sticks in okay. your purse. You always kind of buy it and we have it in the fridge a lot. But yeah, we have it in the fridge because I, I love this, to snack on it. I think if you could have it in your purse, you would. Yeah, if it wouldn't smell, I would definitely have it in your purse. <laughs> Mobito says that you are, he assumes that you are 6'5 and you play, and you professionally play basketball. <laughs> you guys from my stream, you're just writing like She's pushing 4 feet. <laughs> for what? 4 feet. 4 feet? <laughs> no. She's super short and... Um, no, I'm not super short, that's a lie. Did you ever like play on school or... No, we never had like a b b basketball team. No. So, no. That's I'm a not... wrong assumption. <laughs> <laughs> wrong. You are not afraid to be yourself from Noah. Yeah, I don't feel like I am afraid to be myself. Or it took some time, especially with streaming and stuff. For me to like be completely comfortable but i feel like now i'm i feel like i'm really like I myself basically from alex tree fall that you don't love your fans so that's kind of sad <gasps> why would anyone write that <laughs> i feel that's a wrong assumption <clears throat> to say that right now <laughs> you look like you do really well in school yeah, I in university my grades have definitely like like they're good, but I'm not like I'm not gonna sit and like stress about getting the good, best grades ever because that's not how I am basically. So my boy David Gimzig <laughs> is right about the assumption. Yeah, definitely. Like now I feel like I do well in school, but not okay. before when I was in like high school and stuff. Like I didn't care at all. Okay, this is from my boy Tom Davis. Yeah. I don't know you at all, but something tells me you'd be allergic to sesame seeds. Yeah, Tom doesn't know me at all. <laughs> and he does not know that I'm allergic to sesame seeds. But that's correct. I am very allergic to sesame seeds <laughs> for some reason. You want to quit school to become a full-time streamer. I definitely thought about it. Like, Did imagine you? quitting how, school. Imagine how cool it would be, though. Like, if I had the possibility to go full time, but like, it's an incredibly amount of money for me to have an education. And so, if I would drop out right now, it would be so irresponsible. <laughs> and I am not like that at all. So, I'm gonna finish my bachelor degree. And if full time streaming is an option for me, I definitely will explore it. Yeah. But I want to have my degree. I'm not going to drop out. That would just be stupid. Alejandro says, seem to be a nice girl, a good friend to trust in. Are you trustworthy? Yeah, I feel like I am. I feel like yeah. I'm a good girl and you can trust me. True, she's a good friend, yeah. Yeah. Pitch Photography says, you smell like cheese. <laughs> <laughs> Let me smell. <laughs> you want to smell? She smells like soap. <laughs> yeah, I just washed my hands. I guess it's about it. He says you don't like cheese. Depends on how you look at it, because like I love good quality cheese, like blue cheese, camembert, brie, manchego, like okay, good cheese. Expensive ones. Yeah, the expensive ones. But if you give me a pizza slice with with this big of a chunk with melted cheese. I love that shit. Oh, I hate it. That I cannot even look at it. <laughs> it makes me really nauseous. So I like cheese, but not a big amount of melted cheese, if that makes sense. Fred TT99 says that you are a Greek goddess undercover. <laughs> You're right. Guys, actually, She's I am Venus 
Or is that her name? She's a Norwegian goddess undercover, you guys. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Josh oh, no. says you are, are a Valorant god. That's true. Yeah. Have you guys seen she my is radiant, jet place? Though. <laughs> Just kidding. Radiant top 500. Yeah. Chris Polkowski says you accidentally became a TikTok influencer. That is true. I started doing TikTok when the pandemic started. The thing I did when it was COVID and I was doing TikTok was like doing this every day until I'm famous. But it wasn't like to actually become famous. She, she did that because she was bored. Guys. Yeah, I did it because I was bored. And then suddenly I just blew up and I was like, oh shit, I have a lot of followers now. What am I going to do about it? ESB20 says racist. I are you racist? No, I'm not. Are you sure? Don't. Why are you? <laughs> Why do you act weird? <laughs> <laughs> uh, it just says so. She's not way racist. No, I'm definitely not. Kalere Edgar <laughs> says that you're an amazing girlfriend. GF. I feel like I cannot answer that. I can I'm answer it. Yes. Yes. She got that fat juicy. <laughs> <laughs> There's nothing else to add to the assumption, just yes, and I have a big booty. Yes, and um, <laughs> yes. Kit Lake, I assume you're a role-playing type. Is that an assumption? Someone actually wrote that? Yes. That's funny because I am not, or I mean, I, mean, I would ah, love ah. to try. You'll be like stuck in something. Ah. <laughs> <laughs> Step bro, ah. help me. <laughs> I'm stuck. Oh my god, no, but I'm not a role play type of person ever. Bonus round, Panda's assumption of me before he got to know me. Um, well that's over two years ago though. I don't <laughs> yeah. remember what I... Well, actually I did assume that you were doing TikTok, which was wrong at the time. Yeah, he he thought I was a TikToker before yes, he got to know me. This one picture on her Tinder profile looked like a screenshot from a TikTok she has done. But it yeah. wasn't even a TikTok, but it looked like it. Yeah. So I did assume that you were a TikToker before you even became a TikToker, yes. which is I can see into the future. Oh my god, <laughs> oh my god it's crazy. Yes. Okay, that was it for today's video. I hope you guys enjoyed. I definitely had a lot of fun answering these assumptions and it was really fun doing with Panda as well. Um, and also thank you so much for everyone who sent in their assumptions and remember to follow me on my other social medias and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye!